A local townswoman believes that she is actually married to Jesus Christ. I have been dating Jesus for about five years and three months. Um, Do you have any other men, Eli? No, I have not dated any men. It's a very complicated relationship. A lot of people judge me because they don't understand that the man in my life isn't actually there. But I think that's besides the fact. You know, air is here, but you can't see air, can you? No, you can't. You can't see oxygen, can you? But you're still breathing it. She also claims to be the baddest bitch in town because her husband is Jesus Christ, so she claims. Yes, I like to think of myself as the baddest bitch in Tennessee because I'm dating Jesus. And I have been for about seven years. You said you were married to him for five years. That's what I said, five years and six days. What do you mean? Are you questioning how long I've been married to my husband? <laughs> no, no, of course not, ma'am. Oh, uh, 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 okay. That's what I thought. This woman believes that she is mentally and physically married to Jesus Christ. You see, I'm dedicated to Jesus. I haven't dated a man in 50 years. But ma'am, uh, you're 36 years old. That doesn't matter. Yeah, I'm, I, I just don't see the point in dating a man. I hate men. Filthy, disgusting. I just, I don't see no point in giving relations to man because I'm dedicated to Jesus. And that's all I really need in my life, you know? So yes, um, no, I have not dated any man. And um, as far as my sexuality, I am gospel. Who is that man? Who's that? Who's who? That man. Who's who? Oh, that's my lawnmower. He just cuts grass and everything. I have him cut. Oh, girl. He is my lawnmower. Oh, what are you doing? You, you filthy nigga. My lawnmower just does not know decency. I don't like him at all. You know, he's really ugly. It's so, it's so, you're so disgusting. Get out of here, you filthy rotten molder. We asked her what she does on her free time while she's waiting for her husband to return home. I like to sit here outside and look out the beautiful weather. Pray to my husband while he's at work. How is it like being the husband of Jesus Christ? Well, you know, he's too busy helping people all the time, but he always comes back at night to his wife, of course, because I'm his wife. A lot of people, you know, you know, a lot of people don't understand what it feels like being the wife of Jesus Christ. Um, it's hard, you know, because sometimes you have bigger needs than these hoes out there. These hoes be praying for shit that you know that in your heart they don't need, but Jesus has to help them. So I'm just like, you know, you know, in my personal opinion, these hoes ain't shit and they don't need to be given. They don't need to have the prayers answered, but, you know, everybody's equal here. You got to answer to them hoes. The other day this hoe prayed for, uh, <laughs> this hoe prayed. <laughs> prayed to have Jesus in her life. This whole prayed to have Jesus in her life. Bitch trying to steal my man.